Hi there. Thank you, uh, Emmet, Maureen, Thomas, for having me. Uh, my name is Jeroen Wissink. I'm CEO of Uneedle, a microneedle company founded in 2008, <clears throat> just one year after Mark Prasnitz published his first uh, paper on ocular delivery uh, using microneedles, inventing suprachoroidal injection. Thank you, Mark, and the entire ClearSight Bio team for truly pioneering suprachoroidal injections. It's really impressive. Our innovation centers around silicon microneedles. Silicon is a diamond-like semiconductor material. Let's dive in. Here's a direct comparison of our silicon microneedle and a traditional intervitreal or suprachoroidal steel needle. And traditional steel needles have a typical bevel length of one millimeter. Our microneedles have a unique ultra-short bevel a length of just 0.16 millimeters combined with an extremely sharp tip. This tip is etched and not grinded, increasing precision. And does precision matter? Yes, it does. The ultra short bevel prevents vitreous perforation while the microneedle opening is placed entirely within the choroidal space. And in contrast, a longer steel needle bevel leads to imprecise placement, and about 90% of the needle opening is not placed in the choroid, but in the sclera. And the sclera is too tough to inject drugs in. And as a result, drug flow is hampered, and the injection pressure remains high. But due to the lack of precision and the risk of perforation, a steel needle cannot be placed much deeper. So, the ultra-short bevel is inherently safe and keeps the injection pressure low, mitigating the risk of leakage and reflux. Let me show you how that works in practice. This video is created by Powered Research, and there was a logo on the slide, but it disappeared, uh, demonstrating uh, 0.1 injection in a rabbit's eye. As you watch, note the smooth injection. There's no leakage, no reflux. This is precision in action, right? Uneedle is about more than just ophthalmology. We've also developed similar microneedles for vaccination, addressing the reliability issues associated with intradermal injections when using traditional hypodermic steel needles. On the right, an example of our perpendicular skin vaccination. And on the left, a glimpse of our GMP manufacturing, which we have in-house and which is rooted in semiconductor chip technology, ensuring high quality and scalability. For over a decade, we've worked tirelessly to secure regulatory approvals in both the EU and the US, establishing Uneedle as the trusted partner from clinical trials to commercial supply. We partner with leading biotech companies in both oncology and ophthalmology. In oncology, we support clinical trials targeting breast cancer, glioblastoma, and other cancer indications. We facilitate over, facilitated over 10,000 injections, demonstrating the reliability of our platform. In ophthalmology, we partner with Asclepix in their phase 1-2A program. Before we begin, a very big thanks to Amir and Bob Dempsey from Asclepix for granting me the opportunity to share initial results. I don't know where they are, but they're here somewhere. The DISCOVER trial evaluates safety and tolerability of low, mid, and high doses of gersizangitide administered superchoroidally to treat wet AMD. And the trial is being conducted across four clinical sites here in the US, all which have <coughs> of, uh, sites which have previous experience with superchoroidal administration. And the results are really great. Among 15 patients, there were no cases of leakage, no reflux, or any safety concerns. OCT imaging confirmed complete and correct distribution of AXT107 in the suprachoroidal space, and the transient increase in IOP just validates the procedure. The study perfectly highlights the safety and effectiveness of the microneedle platform. And the feedback of the ophthalmologists involved collected in 15 questionnaires, highlighted the superior usability of the devices. For all patients, the overall performance was rated excellent or good. 
unique device features like the use of just one needle per treatment and a low injection pressure were especially praised. A very special thanks to Dr. Almeida, I saw him there, and Dr. Lally for their interviews and their contributions. At Uneedle, we don't just supply needles, we support our partners through our product lifetime. From compatibility studies and animal models up to commercial supply and clinical training. Together with the Centers for Advanced Surgical Exploration, we will start a supracoroidal training center in Amsterdam, including near real surgical specimens. And that's exciting. So, the microneedle platform is complete? Surely not. Our newest project is integrating the needle, the syringe, and the vial into a pre-filled syringe. Inspired by Lucentis and Elia syringes, we've started working with Uli Kuchenbrot and Tilman Rödler from Feta Pharma in Germany on a unique pre-filled syringe with an integrated needle. No extra parts, no drug handling, no filling, no needle attachment. Just Uncap and inject. With a disclaimer, this is for supracoidal injections only. Thank you. <laughs>